everyone, it's John. And Ben. And it's time for an LPS Palooza today because we're going to be opening up four of the mini style sets plus two other little pets to add to our ever-growing LPS collection. Yes, because I really love LPS. You guys have had this grow on me, so now I'm all about LPS. And I saw these little mini style sets a long time ago when we were toy hunting with the Crazy Pony Lady and uh, Lastic from Dollastic. And we're finally going to open them! I'm so excited! Have you made room on your shelf for these? I will make room once I have them open. So, the different characters there are to open are... We have Sunshine Sweetness. Who is a little gorilla. Parker Waddleton. A little penguin. Sugar Sprinkles. A little kitty cat. And Minka. And of course everybody knows Minka is a monkey. Yes. But just in case you don't, I thought I'd say Minka is a monkey from the show. <laughs> and then the two individuals that we're going to be opening are... Gertrude Catterson and Gunther Moody, also known as the Grumpy Cat. <laughs> and we have Pierre DeLong and Siesta Perez, which is a giraffe and a parrot. So I am so excited to be opening these. I cannot yes. wait. And John brought over my spa and the sweet shop so I can kind of show you what these things do in relation to the Design Your World stuff. This pamphlet came in the package with these cubes to show you all the other stuff that they have out there. See, they connect onto the side. Isn't that so cool? So I'm curious how these little mini style sets go together and how they fit with the bigger ones. Okay, so first off, let's show off um, little giraffe. Here's the little giraffe. Pierre. Pierre. It's a bobblehead. <laughs> And a little parrot. So cute. I love these little guys. They come with three deco bits so that you can decorate them. And the Grumpy Cat. Grumpy Cat. And the other little kitty and their deco bits. So he comes with a little tuft of hair with a little bow. Okay. So you can put a bow on the Grumpy Cat. Okay, that is awesome! That's why he's grumpy. Yes. Or she's grumpy. Could be either one. I'm not sure. Well, the name's Gunther. Yeah. So, so it's a boy kitty cat, and they're decorating it with bows and little ponytail hairs. Awesome. We'll do the gorilla first. Move the gorilla over here. The gorilla cut. There's the little gorilla. That's adorable. I know. So cute. Here are the pieces for the cube. You have this. And you put them, slide them all together here. So they go on the opposite sides like that. Then you have, there are two different scenes. There's the outside scene, and then there's like the city walk scene. <laughs> and then you insert that into the back, like that. Oops, went too far. There we go. It goes in the back like that. Isn't that cool? So then there's different ways. So you can have it like that, or according to this, you can have them on other sides. So. You can have it like this, or if you're going to put it on the side and you have this, you can have them going in different directions. Like you can put this and this on different sides. You can have one here and here, or here and here. Oh, I see. So you can put them anywhere you want. But I'll keep it like this. And it comes with three deco bits. So it comes with two leaves. I'm going to put them on the front. The leaves on the front kind of gives it more of a 3D feel. And it also comes with this little panda. Little panda, and I'm going to put that in the gorilla's hand. So now the little gorilla is holding the little teddy bear. Aww. And you can put the little gorilla in the habitat. If I can get her to stand up. She's in there, hanging out in her little home. She also comes with stickers. A little birthday cake and some bananas. So you can put those on there if you want to. So I'm going to go through and I'm going to assemble the rest of these and I'll be right back. Actually, when I was putting this together, I, I misspoke. This little picture scene actually goes in this green cube, not between the pink and the green. And there's little lips that you have to fold it under to get it in there. So it doesn't come out like it did when I put it in there the first time. 
Okay, so I have assembled all four of my cubes. When you do this, be sure to set aside a little bit of time because it took <laughs> Ben, it must have been a good half hour or so. Yeah, well, so the hard part, well, hard slash fun part of these cubes is you can do so many different things with them that it was hard for me to decide which way I wanted to display all these and play with them and put them together because there's just so many different options. So, um, what I think is really cool is you can kind of adjust the the cube fronts and you can make them stick together out this way so you could attach so you could attach like one set of design your world store fronts with animal cubes over here so you could have a two story here connect them all together into the two story over here which is really cool cuz you just keep going and going see like in this picture right here they have them all going to another one. Isn't that neat? You just keep going. And you can also, like on this picture right here, you can also stack up all your little cube fronts together and just one ma make one big tower of cubes for these animals. It's awesome. And what I think is a really cool touch is that the bottoms of these cubes, I'll take a mink out, the bottoms of the cubes have these little little posts in them. I don't know if you can see it very well, but there's a little post right there. So you can stick the animal, your littlest pet shop animal, right onto that little post so they don't wibble and wobble and fall out on you. Which is really handy because these guys do not like to sit in place. They're very unruly. These, um, the little tiny animals have the holes in their bottoms too. So you could actually put your little, your little guys in these cubes also like that so it doesn't have to be minka playing in there it could be your little guys in there too so this is an awesome set i love this i need some more of the design your world stuff so i can like make like this ginormous wall of littlest pet shop it's gonna be like building room of littlest pet shops <sighs> he complains I'm but he loves it it's awesome <laughs> These are so much fun. Okay, Ben, which one was your favorite? The gorilla, the penguin, the cat, or, of course, Minka? Oh, goodness. I absolutely love them all. But I think my favorite is the penguin because you can put the skis on the penguin. It is so cute. And I love the, like, the, the ski lodge type door. I love it so cute but I they they are all awesome I'm glad that I have all four and now I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with them how I'm gonna display them what I'm gonna do I don't know you have so many different ways I know. to display them all I don't know what I'm gonna do down in the comments let us know which one of these little guys was your favorite I, I'm leaning towards a little gorilla oh the Even gorilla facing away too. from the camera right now <laughs> I think that was the cutest one there it is no offense to Minka it's so cute. The gorilla actually kind of reminds me more of like an older LPS, doesn't it? Yeah, a little bit. It does. Just the design. Doesn't yeah. look like the cartoon, but more like old LPS. Yeah. So cute. So, I hope you guys liked this video. And be sure to subscribe to our channel. And like and comment. And don't forget to follow us on Twitter. Instagram. And Facebook. We'll see you next time, everybody. Bye.